Okay, rolling. Hey, how's it going? Uh, Crazy Roger King here. Um, I think today I'm gonna review the new Andrew Garfield ASM movie. Amazing Spider-Man. I liked it a lot. Um, I wrote down some some things I want to touch on about what I thought about what. I mean, I made my own fan film series. I, I'm not sitting back here. I didn't go see with my arms crossed all, okay, let's see what, what they got on me. It's, I, they're all good, man. Like, they're all fun. I did mine for fun and because it's something I wanted to do. I know there are some critical critics out there. Trust me. I feel them. I, I feel what they say. I see what they say. I, I don't care. I'm not critical. I think I love these movies. They're all fun. But like I said, there's just some things. I, it's like, why not? I'm going to talk about it. Um, but just what I thought. I get a lot of people actually ask me to review this and email me about it. So here it goes. Okay, first of all, uh, Andrew Garfield. I thought he made a, a great Spider-Man. His hair is a little too big and puffy. That was the only, like visual thing um, loved his movement long lanky arm I actually on that Facebook movie I remember seeing when he uh, did the fire extinguisher because of uh, something was on fire like the bed was on fire or something I remember just like man I like the way he moved that looked kind of cool it looks like a, a daddy long leg like when you first like try to kill it real quick and you don't kill it it kind of like almost like it, it, it shrivels up a little bit kind of quickly. Like he, he did that when he was doing the fire extinguisher. I thought that was pretty awesome. Um, it's cool that he, he did end up playing Spidey. I, I thought that was a pretty good fit. Um, he could have been a little nerdier. They made him kind of like, almost like, I mean, yeah, he wasn't a cool guy at the school. He, he did get kind of picked on and this and that. He wasn't really, he was kind of a loner, obviously. But, um... I don't know. I think with Gwen, they made him a little too, uh, I don't know, too confident. Because, yeah, he's confident when he has the mask on. But, I I mean, honestly, I think that all kind of disappears in his head once the mask is off. And, you know, he's, he's back to good old him. Um, yeah, so I thought he was a little too confident, a little too... I mean, a lot of people will probably agree with that. They should have made him a little more scared, a little more inexperienced. Like, they should have made it to where, like, he was almost like a child getting his first kiss, you know? So, there was that. Um, what else about him? Uh, I heard he did a, a lot of his own stunts. It says all on, online or, or some or whatever, but... If he did, that's he did awesome. He did a great job. I liked how he was skinny. He's very like just skinny. Like you wouldn't even think he was strong, but I've always liked that. Um Yeah, I thought he was good. I thought he was really good. My favorite scene, I think I I uh wrote about this on a comment, but I might as well talk about it. When he's coming down full spidey suit in the sewer, upside down, coming down. That is such an epic scene. Just so comic book, so, so like, just, it gives you chills when he's coming down, upside down, just nice and slow. And then when he starts spinning and just, psh, 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 just twirling smooth upside down, like making that, it's like a, you know, a spider just setting a trap. That was so clever, yet so simple. I loved it. I thought that was amazing. Um, that part was great. Uh, even when the little lizards are coming, and just his movements. Like, he's so flared and kind of bouncing and kind of... Oh, that looks so cool. That was so awesome. Just in, like, that panicky, moving his head so fast, fingertips flared. Awesome. Such a good-looking scene. And then when the lizard comes in and bla basically blasts him down and, like, they go down into the water and... His tail goes around his neck, and he's getting flushed. Oh, the whole thing, and he got spit out the water. Like, that that whole scene was just, in my mind, like, that's what I, I wish I could have done that. That's what I saw in my head when I was making mine, but obviously, camera work. The, oh, man, it was, it was awesome. I loved it. Loved that scene. Um, Gwen, I thought, whoever, I, can't, I don't even know her name, but she did a great job as Gwen. 
Um, some people are like, oh, they shouldn't have made her so like this or that. I thought she was fine. Um, Captain Stacy, I love De Dennis Leary. He did such a good job as Captain Stacy. Um, I thought that was, he did good. I liked it a lot. He just seemed like that serious dad, you know, and then when he, he turned to be actually on Peter's side, like that was, you know, I was just waiting for it to happen, just like on the comics, and it happened. So I was very happy with Captain Stacy. Lizard, I wish they would have left his jacket on. At least, I mean, when he got came out of that bathroom, out of the toilet, when he tore that out and he came out in the high school, when it was just on him a little, I thought that looked great. I don't know, I don't know why, why not leave it? You know, it looks awesome. Like you gave it, like you had it on there for two seconds and it looked great and then it slips off and then I wish they kept it on, a little more shredded clothing look. Um, didn't, I don't know graphics and stuff like didn't not sure how i felt about him talking so clearly like right when he started talking it's almost the same feeling i got on spider spider 3 when venom was on the brick wall to meet up with sandman and just like the way his mouth looked when he talked i was kind of disappointed i was like uh so it was kind of similar with the lizard it just seemed a little i don't know not not a super amped on it, but it I took it. It's a lizard. They're fighting. They're talking. Whatever. Um, well, movements. I talked about Andrew's movement. I love his movement. The suit. I thought the suit looked great. Everyone talks about the the soles of the shoes, but you know, in the second one, maybe he's gonna upgrade his suit. They, I think they mainly just wanted to show that you know it was a trial run. You know, he didn't know if this this whole spidey thing's gonna work out so I thought it looked fine it looked like he pieced it together and came out cool I mean when I first saw the pictures I was like what are those shoes what are those soles why are they putting the silvery crap but then in the movie it's alright it, it, it makes it more real uh, we talked about changes this and that yeah I think that's it if you guys have any questions about this review go ahead and post them up put yeah I, I would say that's it I don't really know what else to talk about with it or on it so that's my ASM review this is crazy Roger King signing off uh, be sure to subscribe to me and uh, I will see you guys later okay